All I want to do is be better than I was the last week, previous before that, for my team, for myself, and for everybody that's part of the organization. Um, so that's basically my mentality throughout this whole week is chasing improvement. Whatever I did last week, I got to do better and be better. Ball control was such a positive thing last week. This week, is it a, an even bigger challenge against that defense? Um, I, I wouldn't say specifically for, against that defense, but uh, as a goal, as an offensive goal, it's definitely you know keep the ball in our hands and control the game, uh, no matter who we're playing. So I think uh, time of possession and just being able to control the game um, in which way that we do and the way that we want to do is huge and critical for this um, upcoming week. It, it felt like in Seattle that you and Cam kind of had this one-two punch. Do you guys ever talk about that? Yeah, I think it's just something that's kind of just came along this, this year. You know, you, during training camp and through OTAs, we just kind of got to feel like he goes first. I tell him every day, start the car up, and I'm, I'm going to go right behind him. So um, that's just kind of what we got going on. And it's, it's working, too. So we're just going to keep on doing that, keep on working, um, and to, like I said, and chase improvement. Okay, I like that. but. What kind of car? I mean, you can't just say, are you a Ferrari? What are you? Come on, a Lamborghini, anything, <laughs> anything that's foreign and fast. That's what we do with a lot of power. So that's exactly what we is for sure. Love that. Thank you. Kyron, what did you feel like was uh, working well for you on uh, Sunday as you guys were running the ball and, and kind of getting the ground game going there? Uh, I think it was just asserting our dominance up front, you know, starting off um, getting our, putting our hand in the dirt and coming off the ball and showing us, showing them who was uh, going to be in control of this. So I think we started that from the first third down that I know that I was in, um, that we were able to, you know, get uh, out of the gun, run the ball and get behind our pullers. And, and we just executed, this, like, we said, like I said, to the fullest. So I think, just think putting our hand in the dirt and asserting our dominance is huge. What's the inspiration, by the way, for the uh, touchdown celebration? It looked like it was something you uh, brought back with you uh, or carried over from uh, your time in Notre Dame. So, yeah, Notre Dame, I, um, when I first scored, I, yeah, I did the same celebration. And then when I got to the sideline, Coach Kelly was letting me have, letting me hear it. So um, he basically told me that don't ever do that dance again. He doesn't ever want to see it. So I said, you know what, once I score in the NFL, I'm going to do it. So I hope he saw it and I hope he smiled and laughed when I, he seen it. <laughs> I don't know if you're being asked, but I, how familiar are you with the rivalry? Uh, I know it's big. You know, um, I know the Rams and the 49ers, they go way back. There's a lot of history between the two teams and organizations, but like I said, it's just another game for us. Um, we're going in there this week and, um, like I said, exerting our dominance to be able to control the ball as an offense. So I'm excited for, you know, finally join this rivalry or um, everything that comes with it. So let's do it. What challenges uh, do you see there, do, or do there, does their defensive front present? I know you guys are obviously still working through and studying it, but as of today, what, what have you seen? Uh, obviously, they cause a lot of havoc. You know, they got Bosa on the end, and they got a lot of guys that can rush the quarterback. So, um, just being stout up front and as my, as a running back, being able to help my alignment when it, when it's my turn, um, if my blitzer comes or any chips that it may be happen, that's for me to step in and do that. So, I just um, being able to control that offense. I mean, the defensive line up front. I think we're going to be. A, it's going to be a good game for us.